I had come to the book of 1 Samuel, and I was reading this story about, about where God was sending the prophet Samuel to anoint David to be king over Israel. And if, you, if you're familiar with the story in 1 Samuel 16, uh, Samuel the prophet goes there and he, and he asks Jesse to bring all of his sons out before him. And so Jesse brings all of his sons but one. And now the reason he didn't bring this one son because this one son outwardly didn't look like somebody that should be king. I don't really uh, know all the factors, but evidently he wasn't as big, he wasn't as strong, and maybe not even as, as handsome as these other sons uh, of Jesse. And so Jesse just left him out tending the sheep. And so, so he lines up all of his sons before the prophet Samuel. And Samuel, I guess, is walking up and down in front of these guys. And, and, and he's about ready to zero in on who he should anoint as king. He's, he's, he's thinking he's got the mind of the Lord on this thing. And then God spoke to him. And here's what he said. First Samuel 16, 7. Listen to this. I love this. I'll tell you, I read this. I can, I can feel right now what I felt that night 41 years ago when I read this scripture. It says, but the Lord said to Samuel, do not look at his appearance or at his physical stature because I have refused him. Now, here's the important part. For the Lord does not see as man sees. For man looks at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. Man, I'm telling you, there was an explosion.